All right, well, welcome to video two of this series on the overview of the NEC exam products. Uh, here's where we left off. We're going to hit home. We're going to go back. And got a lot of stuff, how to use this guide to prepare you. Going to keep going home. It should be very easy to navigate. We tried to make it easy as we could. Uh, some other useful links, support, info, sales. These are all emails to us. Other formulas, this will give you a printout or what it would, however you want to use that. It will come in handy down the road. Uh, we've got a link to Bureau of Labor Statistics. Tells a lot of information about na electricians on a national level, labor laws, that kind of stuff. <coughs> We have a link to Wikipedia for electricians. It sort of gives a, 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 you know, what electricians, what what is needed of us, what we do, our job occupation, that kind of stuff, our occupation and how we tie into the construction trade. Basic electrical theory, same thing, a little quick link. We just supply these links for your benefit. Uh, Metric prefixes and unit conversions. These are something that's pretty pretty needed. Uh, some of these you'll never use. Um, but just to let you have these at your fingertips. Temperature conversion. Very important kind of stuff. This is something that's going to come in handy on your Ampacity. And we also have that in the Ampacity lessons. Lesson 1. Ohm's Law, Article 90, and Article 100. Let's go ahead and click on that. This is your first lesson here. It's going to give you a brief overview of what we're going to do and how we do it. I've uh, got a link just lets you see what's there. Definitions. It's going to just go over a bunch of definitions. Uh, mainly your main definitions that you're going to find in the code codebook. Uh, these are more of the important ones. They're not all on here, but they're all in your code book. Basic circuits. Here we go. We're going to start out in the lessons going basic. You're going to go over series, parallel, open, short, circuits, control circuits, power, branch, dedicated. And this just gives you a lot of people, especially journeymen or apprentice that are trying to get their journeyman. This is going to come in real handy. A lot of people, we all know how to wire a house or a commercial building. Um, but we never really truly know unless you've taken a class at a college or a vocational school, you're not going to know Ohm's Law and how to figure it out. Well this is going to break it down for you and uh, it will actually help you in the field. So then we're going to move on and you've got Ohm's Law, what we were just talking about. Here's the Ohm's Wheel comes in real handy and it gives a description of what I stands for I current E voltage R resistance W power or watts um, we got Ohm's law goes through it's going to give you some sample stuff here um, and it's just step by step and the whole the whole program is set up like that very easy to navigate and it's going to start you out at the very basic and then work up uh, electrical formulas, here's some Ohm's Law examples. Those are going to come in real handy. They'll show you how to figure out. They're going to ask you the questions and then it's going to work it for you. You're going to see how they actually came up with the values that are the answers. Le electrical formulas, this is a sheet that you can print out. Uh, that's yours to use. Take it with you on the job or which, whatever you want to do. Uh, you could even actually put it into your code book if you have a binder. You gotta be careful and make sure the paper ain't bright white, it'll stand out. <laughs> uh, here's your test. This is the heart and soul of this program. No matter how much you read the code book, how much you look at the code book, you're not gonna know where everything is, you're not gonna understand it, you're not gonna want to read the whole code book. So what we've come up with is tests, questions. You've got to go into your code book and find the answers to these questions. That is the most important thing. Now we will have, like this test here is basically on Ohm's Law. 
Uh, this is not necessarily code questions here. We've got to type in our email address. And we won't have to do this every time for this test. And remember me, start. Oh, forgot to put dot com. And start. Now here we go. Now the thing about these tests, this is a 20 question test, five points each, moderate. You got a time of 20. You can see where your time's clicking down over here. Just like a time test, you've got, you can turn on the audio off. Now, it's multiple choice. You can hit next, you're gonna get a different, gonna get a different question here. And you're gonna get a different question here. And then when you get through, you hit submit and it's gonna give you a grade. So we're just gonna hit this little back button here. It's gonna send us right back here. Here's no, now this is a code test. These are gonna be what's important, very important to do. Uh, we'll just enter our information. Remember me, start, here we go. Accessible, live parts, and this is all gonna be found in your code. There's your measurements. All you gotta do is match up, pick the right one. And the thing about these tests that differ from, is there might be 20 questions in this one, 20 questions in this one, but actually there's about 50 questions in test one, there's about 50 in test two, there's about 50 in test three. And we, there's a bank of questions, so every time you take this test, you're either gonna get totally different questions with a little bit of old ones mixed in, and it's gonna reorganize this test. So you're never gonna take the same exact test twice. Uh, we're gonna move on. Next step is uh, lesson two. Here you go, lesson two, voltage drop. And anytime you see these little blue, these are links to other information. Like, let's just click on this one, it says voltage drop. And what it's going to do is it's going to bring up your internet browser. Here we go, right here. Voltage drop. Wikipedia. We just throw this in there to give you some other sources of information. We've done the legwork for you. Here's all your voltage drop formulas. We've got definitions. Study. This is sort of like practice stuff here. Uh, there's your tests. Voltage drop test. Chapter test. Close book. Voltage drop is very important, but very easy. Once you look at our formulas, you, it's it's easy. You'll you'll understand it because we'll walk you through it. Next step three. That is conductor impacity, and we're going to walk through with you on this. Just start here. There's your temperature conversion things right there very very needed information you've got your study this is going to tell you how to work out your impacity questions you've got your conductor impacity test chapter 3 test closed book test there's probably about 150 questions between these tests real quick we're going to go to next whoops next motors and that concludes this video uh, we will go over the rest of the chapters in the next video video part three uh, thanks for being here uh, please check out our website it's www.necexam.com and pick up your copy today and we'll we'll get on motors in part three thank you